Diego brand Pirates of the Caribbean presents the absolute true tales of Captain Jack Sparrow. Trust us, we're pirates. So there Captain Jack Sparrow was, a prisoner aboard the Queen Anne's Revenge, faced by the woman he wronged. Also, there were new zombies. Creepy thing zombies, of which he was definitely not a fan. He kept hearing this very annoying clunking sound. Of course, being the ingenious and stealthy Captain Jack Sparrow, he speedily made his escape. And where else to hide? The captain's own cabin. Bottles full of tiny ships. Of course, no one had told Captain Jack just who that captain's cabin's captain happened to be. Blackbeard. The most dreaded pirate on all the seven seas. <laughs> Lego brand Pirates of the Caribbean presents the absolute true tales of Captain Jack Sparrow. Trust us, we're pirates. Night in White Camp Bay. The game was afoot. The hunters, a scurvy band of Blackbeard's pirates and, you know, zombies. The quarry, horrible, terrifying, man-eating mermaids. Really much scarier than it sounds. The unwilling bait? Well, I'll let you take a guess. It was up to Captain Jack to lure a mermaid into her range. He did his best to draw one of the lovely creatures close. And that is another reason why Captain Jack doesn't like to work with zombies. Terrible depth of perception. He prefers not to work with crumbling stone towers either. It seems young Philip did better. And that is how Captain Jack Sparrow caught a mermaid. Lego brand Pirates of the Caribbean presents the absolute true tales of Captain Jack Sparrow. Trust us, we're pirates. London, England. Captain Jack Sparrow and First Mate Gibbs had gone out for a wee evening stroll. <laughs> Suddenly, and for reasons entirely unrelated to any outstanding warrants, they found themselves pursued by the King's Man. The Constable Larry were hot on their tails, and their good friend Captain Jack had a brilliant idea. But luck was with him, or safe harbor lay within reach. A mere bit of inspired rearrangement. You may think our story ends there, but aha! And that's the lesson, kiddies. Plan carefully and keep trusty friends by your side. Lego brand Pirates of the Caribbean presents the absolute true tales of Captain Jack Sparrow. Trust us, we're pirates. So there they were, Blackbeard's jolly crew, looking for La Aqua de Vida, the legendary fountain of youth. Demonstrating his fierce loyalty and concern for his comrades, Captain Jack set out on his own. This long-lost treasure hold seemed like a likely place for perils. Too big, too small. See, a glowing cup. Just then, who should he meet but his old friend, Barbosa? <laughs> Looks like Captain Jack was right about those perils. Peril, as it turned out, was much wetter than he had expected. Also angrier and more beard on fiery. <laughs> Lego brand Pirates of the Caribbean presents the absolute true tales of Captain Jack Sparrow. Trust us, we're pirates. The epic pirate duel to end all pirate duels was taking place. All that hard work made a pirate mighty thirsty. Fortunately, Captain Jack had commandeered something appropriate from Blackbeard's cabin back in Chapter 2. Ah. 
complete with tasty ship in a bottle. It seemed to be a mite stuck, though. Aha, what luck! It was Captain Jack's old ship, the Black Pearl herself. And just in time, because all his enemies had teamed up to take him down once and for all. So that's the story of how Captain Jack Sparrow captured a mermaid, discovered the Fountain of Youth, and escaped to tell the tale.